What's up, everybody? It's Jack and Dan. And it's time for another shout-out video. Yeah, it's finally summer. We're doing a summer shout-out, finally. Pamela's going to join us. Hi. She thinks these are so fun. She always watches them, and she's like, hey, I want to do one with you guys, looking through all this cool mail that you get from people. So anyway, we got this little sticker, don't we, dude? Yes. This is our little emblem sticker. We had a few thousand of these made um, quite a while ago, and uh, we started mailing them out to people, and people would do shout-outs on their channel for us, and then um, basically we would do one for them and kind of help each other out. And whenever they send us anything, whether it's a postcard or a letter or, you know, a sticker we put it on Jack's Wall of Fame over his big Aqua Bridge tank. And it's getting pretty huge, isn't it? it it's pretty big. Yeah, you need a better room. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're just going to kind of run through some of these. Um, we did send some out to this young lady. Really, really super awesome lady. Very talented lady. Her name is Ray's Way Overdoing It. And uh, she's super, super cool. She just kind of sent us like a billboard of her channel there. This young lady does uh, singing and she actually makes songs up about other channels a lot of time like as a contest, right? Yes. So if you win a contest that she does, she makes a song up about your channel. It's a pretty creative approach. That's awesome. Have you ever had a song made up about your she, channel yet? She has not. Oh. She has not. So maybe, maybe she will sometime soon or maybe <laughs> we'll win a contest to get a song made about us. Wouldn't that be fun? Yeah, it'd be interesting. All right, this is another really awesome channel. Uh, this uh, person here does rescues and, you know, uh, ties tons and tons of animals called the Farm at 64. Apparently, the name doesn't have anything to do with what they do other than the fact that they say that their children named their channel that. So that, that's a little, little hedgehog there. Got all kind of animals, all kind of rescued animals. A really, really neat channel does a lot of showing animals grow like little birds and things anyway a very very interesting channel i believe this person i'm not sure if this person is a man or a woman sometimes we talk to these people we forget if they're male or female or whatever so i keep saying they uh please forgive me but uh this person is also a teacher apparently and um does a lot of teaching with animals and things like that but that is a really great channel we're going to post that uh little emblem up on jack's wall of fame as well so the next channel we're going to give a shout out to is uh, Wolf Carey. So. Yeah, Wolf Carey is a dog, actually. And the channel is about Wolf Carey. And it's kind of from the dog's point of view. And, of course, they love watching Lacey and George Costanza. And he always comes and makes the most nicest comments, always. And we just want to give them a shout out. Really, really cool channel. Don't post a lot, but post really fun videos and have awesome dogs. That's wonderful. All right, next shout out goes to one of our buddies, Shen RC. We've talked about Shen before. And also has a, a fishing channel and is the brother of Golden Fish Tanks. Yes. Who, of course, has a wonderful, wonderful fish channel. We gave him a little shout out on our last um, shout out video just because we think they're really cool brothers and they have really cool channels. Um, but he, he thought it was very nice that we did that. And he sent us a gift, though, didn't he? Yes, he did. What did he send us there? Either. Bay, uh, beta bio gold, I believe it's a type of like food thing. Yeah, it's it's beta food, yeah, and it's kind of a neat little thing. You kind of cut it open and feed your beta with it. Sent us quite a few of these for our beta. Thanks, Steve. That was really really nice. And also sent us uh, some official stickers. We just kind of printed out uh, his emblem, but he sent us some stickers. This guy has I don't know how many RCs. I would say at least a hundred. Probably. Really really cool channel. Does like point of view slow motion stuff for his RCs and everything. Really, really neat channel. If you're in any way into RCs or nature or anything, check out his channel. You'd love it. George got a little jealous because because we were hanging out with Mommy, so he wanted to be in the video too. <laughs> What's up, everybody? <laughs> Next shout-out we're doing goes to Big Time Fish Keeper. And this gentleman has a wonderful channel, lots of awesome tanks. It's a lot of fish similar to us, has a lot of plecos, has a big sailfin pleco like we do. Um, does a lot of different... Uh, videos about um, discus, angelfish, angelfish breeding, has a beautiful beta named Balboa, and just has a great fish keeping channel. Uh, really does a very nice job and, 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 uh, and is always very nice and complimentary to our channel. So thank you so much, Big Time Fish Keeper. Check out the channel. Again, all of these channels will be listed in the description in the pinned comment. You can go check them out. You can see if these are the kind of uh, you know people that you like to connect with and check out their videos and stuff. 
All right, Lacey got jealous that George was up here, so Lacey <laughs> had to come up here too now for the shout out video. <laughs> so the next shout out is going to JMF Aquatics, which stands for Just My Fish. And he made this wonderful little emblem for us. Isn't that cool? That is awesome. And I uh, actually printed that out. I just made a small one to go up on the Wall of Fame, but you know, uh, kind of gave us that as a background we could use or something. Yeah, it looks pretty, pretty interesting. Very, beautiful. very, very nice. Thank you. Uh, Just My Fish has, of course, much of an aquatic uh, channel, is in the process of building a pond, came across an issue with a big bee's nest recently. It was pretty dangerous. Uh, you can see that video on his channel. But also does uh, marine fish, uh, has a lot of cichlids, beautiful tanks, beautiful aquariums. Um, very much looking forward to seeing how you know, his venture goes with his pond uh, after this setback. He's the one we were just watching that got bit and had to give himself a shot with an EpiPen and everything. So, Ooh, yeah. yeah, pretty pretty dangerous stuff. See, then she comes up here, but then she gets fidgety. <laughs> All right, next shout out is going to go out to a really, really cool lady named Ernie Hatmaker. And Ernie is a really, really, really awesome young lady. Um, they live in, uh, I forget what state. She makes hats? No, she does not. But she does a lot of farming uh -huh. and just a lot of funny stuff, too. Um, really, really, really cool lady. Really cool husband. And they just have a lot of fun. She just seems like the kind of person that you just like to hang out with and, and have fun with. Very, very fun lady. We love watching her videos. She also does shout-out videos every single Sunday. And uh, featured us in one of her shout-out videos, which was very, very nice. Thank you. Yes, thank you very much, Ernie. And um, also, we sent her some of our stickers, and she did a little funny video where she made a little ribbon in her hair with it. She just <laughs> does funny stuff, and she's just got a great sense of humor. And uh, I, I, I really one of those people that we like a lot on uh, on YouTube that uh, that just seems very cool and has fun with it, just like we try to do. You know, not try to be too you know too crazy about it. Just have fun with it. All right. So the next shout out is going to go to a really awesome fish tuber guy. Does not have a big channel. Absolutely should. But he's kind of new to the whole scene. And this is Tommy's Tanks. Tommy is one of the coolest guys and has some of the most amazing tanks you're ever going to see. In fact, he kind of was one of the inspirations for us to, when we changed the Aqua Cave, to build um, Mount Ropefish the way that we did. He has an unbelievable amount of massive lava rocks in his aquariums, doesn't he, buddy? huge red lava rocks, tons of tanks, an entire fish room off of his kitchen in his house. Wow. One of the most impressive, coolest fish rooms that we've ever seen. Um, not necessarily the biggest or the amount of tanks. It does have a lot of tanks and they are big, but it's just very nice. It's part of his house, kind of like our tanks are. It's not like some basement corridor. Not that there's anything wrong with those kind of fish rooms. I know a lot of people just want to breed fish or collect a lot of fish. But we also think it's kind of cool when you have it as a main part of your house. Um, and, and that's the way we do ours. That's the way Tommy does his. It's really, really neat the way he has it. And and anyway, check out Tommy's channel. Go over there and give him some subs. He, check it out. Yeah, he really should have way more subs. Does a lot of very informative videos about feeding, about filtration, um, builds you know, tanks. And it just has an amazing channel. So check out Tommy's Tanks. We did send him some stickers. He gave us a nice little shout out too. Thanks again, Tommy. George is all about being in the video, but Lacey just lays down like whatever. I just want to be on your lap, Jack. Right. It's so funny. Who's our next contestant on the Price is Right? <laughs> <laughs> the next person we're going to give a shout out to, guys, is King's Aquarium and Ant World. And if you've not checked out these people's channels, they are super, super cool. They're also from the UK, like a lot of the folks that we have met. Um, and they did a little bit of a contest where we had to like guess some things. And they do contests a lot and they do shout outs a lot and they're really, really nice. And they're called Aquariums and Ant Worlds because they also have ants. And a lot of people have these like huge, you know, ant kind of- Like an ant farm? Ant farms, yes. Wow. And they connect them and it's really cool and it's really neat and it's really nice. Ants, ants are three times stronger than, what, what, what's the term? The they humans? Have, they, they have incredible. Strength. They can lift a yeah. hundred times their weight. They're three times stronger than George Costanza. I can tell you that. Isn't yeah. that song just what makes that little old ant think he can move a rubber tree? Forward? Yes, that is a song. <laughs> Thanks for reminding us of that song. Right, Jack? <laughs> but 
uh, they do a lot of things about ants and, you know, they have some really cool tanks. And of course, they're a wonderful family, very friendly, do lots of great things. Anyway, in the contest, we won a pen and it, their last name is King. They call it King's okay. Aquarius. And you needed a pen. And I needed it. Nice. I have like literally two pencils left in my yeah. pen holder. Yeah, you I need a pen. pen. There's aliens around here that take pens. They don't take our, well, George Costanza takes the socks, but he there's aliens socks. taking my pens. Aliens. Look at this cool pen that they sent awesome. with their little emblem on that. I don't know if it's going to focus. King's Aquarium and Ant World. Very Thank nice. You. Thank you so much. I am going to hide this so that the aliens or Pamela doesn't take them. <laughs> I don't take them. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, you. check out King's Aquarium and Ant World. We'll put a link in the description as well. All right, guys. So the last shout out for today is going to come from Daniel from Creepy Gallery. This is another one of uh, our awesome Australian friends that we met on YouTube. Good day, Mike. Good day, Daniel. Good day. <laughs> <laughs> Let us know, Daniel, if uh, Pamela did a good no, uh, Australian accent. There. How's the Sheila's up there? I'll do it. Good eye, Mike. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. Good eye. Yeah. Jack's was pretty good. <laughs> um, he says, good day, Jack and, uh, Jack and Dan. I hope uh, you like these handmade porcelain towels. Well, first of all, Daniel, uh, we, we sent him some stickers all the way to Australia. Wonderful, wonderful, nice guy. Has a great uh, channel. Does all kinds of different things. Has ocelots and fish and... <laughs> lizards and snakes and and uh yeah sometimes she's not comfortable to have on your on your lap <laughs> she's funny she's very muscular she's muscular she's heavier than george but anyway daniel's an awesome guy his channel is very very nice he's always made very nice comments to us and and likes our channel very much and we really appreciate that he actually makes porcelain tiles and made us several of these. That's amazing. Shipped them all the way from Australia. Wow. Very, very nice. Check these out for Jack's Wall of Fame. That's awesome. Now, again, all of these things, we hang on Jack's Wall of Fame, which is really nice. Um, this is the emblem from his channel. It's like, you know, one of these little kind of... Uh, you Nautilus. Know, yeah, Nautilus kind of thing. It could be, could be a millipede, yeah, I'm thinking. Could be, something of that nature. Um, very, very, very neat. And he does do, you know, isopods, all kind of things like that. Made a... Uh, Jack and Dan emblem. That's really awesome. Which was really kind of cool. Kind of a little 3D. These are like little, little porcelain tiles. Aren't they neat? Yeah, I like the um, gloss or the... Yeah, they're very glossy. And then they did a couple of fish, and I can't tell exactly what kind of fish these are. Look like they might possibly be koi. Yeah, koi. I think um, this is one here. They have the more beautiful, drink. beautiful. Look how shiny that is. Yeah. Look how nice that is. And then made another one here. What a, what a beautiful, beautiful work of art these are. These are all going to go on Jack's Wall of Fame. Again, all of these uh, people's uh, channels will be in the description. And, you know, what we do is we basically, like, look, we, we say, hey, if you'd like some of our stickers, we'll send you some of our stickers. And we'll send them anywhere in the world, right? Yeah. We've sent thousands of them out all I over mean, the place. I'd say probably the furthest we send is Australia. Mm -hmm. um, Britain, we've sent some. Obviously, Canada. All over the whole world. All you whole two world. are awesome. Maybe one <laughs> Russia, I think. That's, That's nice, awesome. Pamela. We've awesome. sent them all over. Well, if you would like some of our stickers, just email us. We have our email in the description as usual. We'd love to send you some. And if you'd like to send us anything at all, even if it's a sticker or a picture, or if you just email us, we gladly print it out and we'll put it on Jack's Wall of Fame. We like connecting with all these other YouTubers and it's really, really fun. If you're not a YouTuber and you like our stickers, same thing. Let us know. We'll gladly mail you some. And if you'd like to be on Jack's Wall of Fame, again, even if you're not a YouTuber, you can gladly send us something or email us something and we'll put that up. That'd be really neat. People have been doing this. Uh, we've been doing this now for, well, about two and a half years. Yes. Actually, yeah. if you go to our YouTube channel, our oldest, our oldest video is actually this tank, but it just has those two um, Avatar rocks. It has the Avatar rocks, but it has it has the um, Aqua Cave and then it has the penthouse coming out the top all the way to the ceiling. That was the yes. first video we did. I remember our first video. We at least, we at least had like 40 bloopers. Yes, we have uh, bloopers. We should probably bloopers. come up with a blooper video. We yeah. should keep some of these bloopers because it would be fun. A lot of people do do that. That's one of the things that Ernie Hatmaker does in her videos too. And lots of other people do. But uh, anyway, you'll notice that the scape of this tank is a little different. We did mention that we got a little inspiration from Tommy and we did change things. That is because Iostigi has outgrown her cave and she's just getting too big for it. So we decided to take it down. We inevitably are going to be working on an indoor pond for her. We live in Cleveland, and I know a lot of people like ponds here, but we just feel that where we live with all the leaves and the tassels from the oak trees and the helicopters and the acorns and all the wildlife, we would Too like much. to just make one inside. And we do have the room, and we have a good place for it. So we are going to be making an indoor pond for her, probably some fish friends as well. 
And uh, that'll be coming up this summer sometime when we get around to it. She is in a temporary tank hanging out in my office for now. And so this video is going to be the longest video we ever posted. It's almost 40 minutes long where we completely tore this tank down and rescaped it and did lots of other things as well. Um, and we talk about a lot of specific things and go over a lot of things. We are going to be doing some more videos on this, also showing where we get the bamboo from and adding some new bamboo to it, which we've already done, but we haven't posted the video. And also we're going to be doing some new lighting to this tank, some laser lights, yes. which are really cool. Uh, we did used to have some on here. We moved them. We're going to bring them back and we're going to show people where they can get those from and how to do it. It's very easy. It's very inexpensive and it's a really cool effect for your stand and for your tanks. So stay tuned for all that stuff, guys. If you haven't liked and subscribed, please do. And, we'll, you know, we'll help our channel to grow. Turn on the notifications so, you know, you obviously know what the notifications do. Yeah. But thanks. And, uh, you know, just stay tuned because we got a lot more fun stuff to come. Thanks so much, guys. Hit Have the an... subscribe button. <laughs> thanks for hanging out, George and Lacey. Tired, but she I think, probably says bye. I think Lacey's asleep. Jones Costanza says, thanks for having me. Bye-bye, guys. Take care. Bye.